Hello. Today I'm going to do a review of the vegan chocolate pack by Hey Tiger. Here's the, here's how it came in the mail in this awesome gold, gold bubble wrap pack thing. Give me a second to set up the overhead shot and we'll get this thing open. Hello up there. All right. How are we gonna do this? Here's another look at that. All right. Yeah, this company does handmade stuff that is, um, so they buy their cocoa at above market price from some country somewhere like it's all there's a lot of ethical considerations in the way that they run their business and source their products and do their things in general so I thought that it would, so I thought that it would be a good uh, thing to check out and show people what it's all about Ethically sourced, premium, handmade Australian chocolate brand. I like the sticker. It's very funky. I wonder if I'm getting that in shot at all. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. All right, but game changer hazelnut butter vegan dark. Hmm. Dreamy dark signature blend eighty for five percent plain vegan dark. Fairy bread vegan milk. And hello officer. This is probably the coolest box. Vegan and vegan and smoke whiskey and smoke vegan dark. All right. I guess we'll change the camera angle again and do some eating. <laughs> Signature blend, plain, vegan, dark. There's a lot of gold. I like the... Uh, I shouldn't be trying to talk while I'm making noise. Ooh. What I'm going to do is just take a piece. I'll take the 
the big bass. A short cut there. We're waiting for ambient noise to decrease. Okay. is dark. Consistency is perfect. Of all the dark chocolates I've had, it's like the least, the least bitter, I guess. I don't know, it's just it's just something pleasant about it. Seven point five out of ten. That's what I'm giving that. Okay. Oh, I need to uh Just some filtered water, whiskey and smoke. Hmm. Okay, this is a 65. Slightly less dark. Oh, it's in Ghana, that's where it's uh, where the cocoa is sourced. This bar supports communities in Ghana. You probably won't be able to read that. Um, but trust me, that's what it says. Okay. Oh, there's a thing here. strongest smell is actually the whiskey kind of smell. Mm. Okay. Definitely much more, much more of a smell than the plain dark. you immediately. Malt whiskey flavor and Scott whiskey flavor. Mmm.
that easily, dis- it says only 0.5% of each, so it's like 1% whiskey flavor. It's all I can taste. All I can taste is whiskey. I can't taste anything else. <laughs> <laughs> mm, mm. Oh, that's something. I'd probably give that a seven. I don't really go much on whiskey. It's still really good though. There's something different about the experience of this, how it melts compared to other chocolates. Like your regular supermarket stuff, you know. Something, I don't know, you can tell that it's not made by a machine or whatever. That's Poof. All right. Game game chaser. Changer. 62%. So we're going down in percentage each time, pretty much. Yeah, each time. We're going from most to least cocoa percentage. Good hazelnut butter and dark chocolate. It's <laughs> the hazelnuttiness. <laughs> These noises and expressions I'm making, they probably seem negative, but they're positive. <laughs> it's just overwhelming positive. That's the, the most smellful of them all. So far. Mm. Okay. Didn't quite palate palate cleanse enough. Okay. We're good to go. So soft. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know how to describe food in general, but I would say. Kind of like a the 
the nuttiness of the hazelnut is it's more nut than hazel this hazelnut does that make sense mm. It's a strong eight. Strong eight. So much more creamy than the others. Oosh. So this is like a collab one. Hey Tiger crossed with Claire Ritchie. Okay. food in any way shape or form but it smells like smells it smells as if there are smells inside I don't know what it's like a flowery something this one has the longest list of flavor, uh, ingredients as well Yeah, and this one's a 45% cocoa. There's about 20 different things happening. This is an entire experience. Much more so than the others. The others were eating chocolate. This is just, it's a lot. It's mega a lot.
that one gets like an 8.5 just because there's so much happening <laughs> all right i really didn't know what much else to say about these they are good and you should buy them and eat them Ooh. Okay, that's all. Buy them, eat them, and experience them. I don't know. That's all. Okay, bye.